Welcome to our channel. Rosamond Pike shares update on skiing injury that messed up her face prior to the Golden Globes. It's not the no, one preferred strategy for entering award season, the Saltburn actress joked of her injury. In an exclusive conversation with P.O.P.L. at the 2024 BAFTA Tea Party on Saturday, Pike, 44, revealed that she is mostly healed from the skiing injury that she hid under a veil at the Golden Globe Awards last week. Her chin is still a bit messed up underneath, but I'm not going to show you, the Saltburn star tells the Tea Party's red carpet, adding that the wound is healing nicely. Related, Margaret Robbie wears dark denim ensemble for Saltburn screening with Emerald Fennel and Rosamond Pike. Though the injury is not visible anymore, her face, and particularly her chin, was completely messed up after the Christmas accident on the slopes, she says. If I showed you pictures on my phone from January the 1st, you would say, ah, Pike says of the injury. And while the Gone Girl star is doing much better now, she asserts that it is not what you want to do. Smash your face up two weeks before the Golden Globes. It's not the no, one preferred strategy for entering award season, she adds. Related, Rosamond Pike says she buries her awards in her garden. I think it's awkward to display them. Pike, who wore a stunning floral Simone Rocha gown to the BFT event, arrived at the Golden Globes red carpet in a very different ensemble an all-black outfit complete with a decorative lace fascinator covering most of her face. After debuting the look, the star made headlines not only for being a globe-style standout, but also for the unique, face-obscuring headpiece. While chatting with Variety reporter Mark Malkin at the awards show, where she received a nod for her role in Saltburn Pike, revealed that the lacy accessory was a protective veil for the occasion. I had a skiing accident over Christmas, she told Malkin. Not what you want knowing you're coming to the Golden Globes on the 7th of January. Though she appeared to be largely unscathed from the accident, which occurred about two weeks prior to the award ceremony, Pike said it left her face entirely smashed up. So she thought to herself, I need to do something. After Malkin pointed out that her face appeared to be largely free of injuries underneath the lace, Pike said that she was mostly healed, but decided to include the fascinator in her globe's ensemble anyway. Rosamond Pike donned protective veil for Golden Globes. Rosamond Pike donned a protective veil at the Golden Globe Awards after being involved in a skiing accident. The 44-year-old actress, who was nominated for Best Supporting Actress in a Motion Picture for her role in Saltburn, walked the red carpet on Sunday. 07.0124, in a lacy all black ensemble complete with an elaborate fascinator by Philip Treacy that partially covered her face, and she explained the headpiece wasn't chosen just for fashion reasons. Speaking to Mark Malkin for Variety and Entertainment tonight's pre show special, she said, It's a protective veil for the occasion. I had a skiing accident over Christmas. Not what you want knowing you're coming to the Golden Globes on the 7th of January. The accident left Rosamond with her face entirely smashed up, so she felt she needed to do something. However, when Mark pointed out she looked injury-free, the Gone Girl star admitted she was healed, but still opted to keep the veil. She said, I kind of fell in love with the look. And Rosamond admitted she was channeling her saltburn alter ego. Lady Elspeth Catton, with her stropless black vintage dyer gown and black accessories. After Mark noted her look evoked that of her character, she agreed. Well, you know, you have to channel it, don't you? Either a sort of weird funeral vibe, or maybe she wore black for her wedding. The actress felt the psychological thriller had given her the opportunity to play and be extreme with her awards get up. 